Just in time for the return of Major League Baseball, it's the Mini Baseball Bat American Flag. For this patriotic project, you're going to need 13 18-inch Mini Baseball Bats. The first step is to set aside seven bats, which we're going to paint a gloss red. You'll have to let the top side dry and then roll them and paint the other side. Give them a couple of good coats. Then take the six remaining bats and we're going to paint them as well, only this time a gloss white. Once all the paint is good and dry, it's time to lay them down barrel to handle. Then taking a tape measure at the top left corner of our bats, we're going to make a mark at 7 inches on that top left barrel. Then we'll make marks at 7 inches on the next 6 barrels and handles. Then we'll mask off the remaining parts of each of those 7 bats. And then it's time for a couple of coats of some dark blue gloss paint. After those dry thoroughly, it's time to unmask these bats and see our work. Ah, oh, they turned out great. Now we're going to need a backing to hold all these bats together. I'm going to use an eighth inch piece of plywood. I'll measure off 12 and a half inches and make a mark on both sides of the wood. Draw a line with my straight edge, and then cut that piece out. Cut it out! And then a little sandaroo to keep it smooth. Then I'm going to paint one side a dark color. This is just to prevent seeing any gaps when all the bats are attached. Now we're going to lay out all the bats again, only this time we're going to flip them so the blue square is in the top right. Then using a straight edge, I'm going to make sure all the handle ends that stick out are straight. Then it's time for our backing, which we're going to flip over with the dark side facing the bats and lay it down over all 13 bats. I'll be using a handful of wood screws to attach the back to the bats. First, holding the bats together nice and tight, I'm going to drill a small pilot hole through the back and into the first bat. Then, taking a wood screw, and in this case, a screwdriver, I'm going to slowly screw that back into the bat. I'll use a power screwdriver in a bit, but I just want to make sure this first screw is lined up and nice and tight. Then, I'll repeat this same process in the top opposite corner. Now that things are tight and fitted, I'll drill the remaining holes in the barrels. Then using a power screwdriver, I'll install the rest of those screws. The backing is installed and our mini baseball bat American flag is starting to take shape. Now the only thing missing from our stars and stripes flag are the stars. So I picked up a roll of white 3 quarter inch adhesive stars and started laying all 50 stars in place on both the bat handles and the bat barrels. It's done and looks super cool. Now if you want to hang it, you're going to need a standard 10 pound sawtooth hanger. So I'll attach that with the included nails. And our mini baseball bat American flag is done. Just in time for Major League Baseball. Play ball!